Hello and welcome back. This is part four of Server Plus Client Advanced um, tutorial. So let's carry on quickly. Um, I'm just going to comment this out because we don't have it yet. And um, let me explain to you this RPC um, function that we created in the other tutorial. So we're stating that this function below is an RPC call. And um, we're going to have the same function on our server but what's inside the function can be different so when we RPC call the server this one won't be affected the server will be affected yeah but when the server sends it back to us this one's gonna be read and the servers not gonna be read if, if you get what I mean there's a bit of confusion over this All right so when we're calling it this here it could be anything it could be anything it will not be called but if the server calls this RPC function here on this client then it will be called that's why we're sending an RPC call with you know our login request and then it's sending us back either yes you can log in or yes you and then if you can't it won't send you the login request and you're still gonna be there alright hope that made sense okay so what we're gonna do now is we want a register 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 yeah in our else function what we want to create is another is another another GUI yeah GUI group and this is gonna be yeah, about the same same size. Username, we're gonna do yeah, username equals GUI dot text area new rec uh two hundred by one hundred by two hundred by twenty five and once again you pass in the perimeter. So you should know what this means but I'll go over it your username up here is your variable string variable and that's equal to this GUI text area and then what that GUI text area is once again equal to the username pretty simple and do the same with the password uh, we're Alright. So next we want to create the register to create account basically. Network view dot uh RPC. Hmm. Yeah. Dot RPC and it's gonna be register. RPC mode mode ah dot server yeah username password uh email I'm gonna do my permafrost support hotmail dot co uk and then finally my age and the network player <coughs> oops Ta -da. Um, I'm not sure why I put it in an if block not sure of that okay Ta -da. Next, we have to create that function. So RPC public void register string, and then we need to pass in all these parameters again. So it's username username string password, 
and then networking network the network player 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 and capital so the two sec all right so in our server we're gonna have um, lowercase for all these parameters and that is because I've, I didn't finish this but that's because um, the server has got to have two parameters basically to check and to send so what I usually do is I use small um, letters on the server and big letters for the client so yeah that's just a nice tip after the password we also want a string email an int age and then yeah finally the network player okay within here you don't want to add anything let's check for any errors what have I done wrong method group username password hmm oh okay yeah network network dot player yeah yeah there we go so I hit play yeah we gotta attach something to that Uh, so yeah, click on your login, and we have to add a component uh, network view, and I guess I should be fine like that. Here's that stupid GUI message. Can't send no connection started. That's fine, and then we can't click anything because we are not connected. Alright, well, that's pretty much it for this script. It's all done. Next time we're going to start building probably the, the core. Yeah, the core. Alright, thank you for watching, guys. Bye-bye.